So, you've probably figured out I've got a Savage, an HPI Savage X 4.6, part number 867. This is an older Savage, it's discontinued at this point, but it is still badass. I got a killer deal on this thing, it was brand new, I got it from a buddy at work, and it essentially, originally came with a radio and a transmitter, and it was missing that, and it was missing some other parts, there was no roto start. So, I bought it from him, I bought what I needed, I bought the Roto Start end, it's just the shaft, I didn't buy the whole assembly that requires a battery that you put inside, charged up my screw gun, and it worked, thankfully. This just barely works, and it will not unless the engine is preheated with a heat gun, else it will fire. But this thing has massive power. I've never owned a Savage before or any Nitro Monster truck, but I was blown away. That was the fourth tank, that footage of it running. Uh, I have not leaned out the engine. I have not messed with any of the needles. The manual says that they should be flush. That's how they were. That's how they're supposed to be to break in the, the engine. I just left everything. Um, but it is fast once the engine heats up. It freaking pops wheelies and hauls butt. So far, I don't have any real complaints about the truck. The steering servo is kind of wimpy. When the truck is on the ground, the front tire is on the ground. Um, it's, it's just kind of wimpy. I mean, it, it does steer, it gets the job done, but when you lift the front of the truck up and then steer it when the tires aren't on the ground, there's no resistance there. Uh, it steers a lot better. So a steering servo, a better steering servo torque-wise would really suit this truck. I'll probably do that later on, uh, something there. But for now, um, other than that, it's just this stupid roto start system. Uh, I, I'll, I'll keep using this uh, until it really irritates me and then maybe I'll go buy a little roto start system, but I don't really don't want to buy one of those. So expect to see more from this monster truck in the future. I'm going to do a lot more running videos. I want to see it jump. I want to see it climb some hills. And I want to see some massive roosts coming out of these tires. I did what I could earlier. It was in my backyard. It was starting to get dark. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed that footage. Well, guys, that's my time. Thanks for watching this video. If you want to see future videos of this truck or other RC-related stuff, click that subscribe button if you're new. Follow along. If you want to see information on Savage trucks, current trucks, this one is discontinued, this particular model, but the new ones are pretty darn nice. So if you're interested, I'll put a little link down below in the description box. And until next time, peace.